Have you ever pondered over the significance of artificial rivers in our rapidly evolving world? This question may not be one that you consider on a day-to-day -day basis, but the concept of artificial rivers is becoming increasingly critical as we face the challenges of the 21st century. Artificial rivers by definition are man-made waterways that are designed and constructed for a variety of purposes. They play a pivotal role in agriculture, where they facilitate irrigation of vast tracts of land, enabling us to cultivate crops even in regions with low rainfall. This has a direct impact on food security, a concern that is becoming more urgent with the growing global population. In addition to agriculture, artificial rivers are integral to urban development. As cities expand, the demand for water increases. Artificial rivers can help meet this demand, providing a sustainable water supply for residential use, industrial processes, and even recreational activities. They can transform the urban landscape, creating vibrant, livable spaces where communities can flourish. Moreover, artificial rivers are emerging as a viable solution to water scarcity, a problem that is escalating due to climate change and over-exploitation of water resources. By harnessing the power of engineering, we can redirect water from areas of abundance to regions that are parched, ensuring equitable distribution of this precious resource. Now, let's narrow our focus to a country that is harnessing this concept in a big way. Afghanistan, a nation that has faced its fair share of challenges, is undertaking an ambitious project that is poised to change its destiny. They are in the process of building what will be Asia's largest artificial river, a feat that is as daunting as it is inspiring. This endeavor speaks volumes about their resilience and determination to overcome adversity, to create a brighter future for their people. It's a testament to the innovative spirit that is driving the world forward, towards a future where resource scarcity is a thing of the past. Now let's delve into how Afghanistan is embarking on creating Asia's largest artificial river. Afghanistan, a country known for its rugged mountains, is now taking a giant leap towards sustainable water management. Today we delve into Afghanistan's audacious plan, the construction of Asia's largest artificial river. This ambitious project is nothing short of a marvel, an engineering feat that will transform the landscape of the country and potentially revolutionize water management in the region. So, what exactly does this project entail? To start with, the planned artificial river is projected to stretch across several hundred kilometers, cutting through various terrains from the mountainous north to the arid south. The river's location is strategic, designed to reach as many communities as possible, providing them with a reliable water source. This remarkable endeavor is expected to take several years to complete. The timeline, while ambitious, is a testament to Afghanistan's commitment to sustainable development and the well-being of its people. The river's sheer size alone is enough to make it the largest of its kind in Asia. But size isn't the only thing that makes this project noteworthy. The river will serve multiple purposes, from irrigation to hydropower generation and even flood control. And how about the technology behind this venture? It's set to incorporate state-of-the-art techniques for water conservation and management. Think of it as a perfect blend of traditional wisdom and modern technology, designed to ensure the optimal use of water resources. This venture is a clear manifestation of Afghanistan's vision for a sustainable future. It's a bold statement that, despite challenges, the country is determined to leverage its resources and technology to improve the quality of life for its people. But like any grand endeavor, this project comes with its own set of challenges. What are the potential hurdles in the realization of this mammoth project, and how will they be addressed? One of the primary challenges in the execution of this ambitious endeavor is the securing of adequate funding. Constructing Asia's largest artificial river is a costly affair, with expenses spanning from initial planning to the final phases of construction. However, Afghanistan has been proactive in securing financial backing from international donors and investors, demonstrating the project's potential for long-term economic and environmental benefits. The construction phase also presents its own set of challenges. Building an artificial river of this scale requires advanced engineering skills and resources. Afghanistan is addressing this by partnering with global engineering firms and promoting local training programs in relevant fields. This not only ensures the project's success, but also contributes to the country's capacity building. The environmental impact of such a large-scale project cannot be overlooked. There's a delicate balance between progress and preserving natural ecosystems. To mitigate potential negative effects, Afghanistan is committed to conducting comprehensive environmental impact assessments and implementing sustainable construction practices. 
This includes minimizing disruption to existing wildlife habitats and ensuring the river's water source is sustainably managed. Geopolitical issues could also pose a challenge. The artificial river's route might cross political boundaries, potentially leading to disputes. Afghanistan has taken preemptive measures by engaging in diplomatic discussions with neighboring countries. These talks aim to foster cooperation and mutual benefits, ensuring the project's smooth progression. Furthermore, the country is prepared to navigate unforeseen challenges. A robust contingency plan is in place, allowing for flexibility and adaptability in the face of unexpected obstacles. This readiness ensures the project's resilience and paves the way for its successful realization. With challenges identified and solutions mapped, the journey towards the completion of this project is underway. So, what is the path forward for this project and how will it impact Afghanistan and Asia? As we delve into the future of this ambitious venture, the journey is as exciting as it is complex. The next steps for Afghanistan's artificial river project involve a series of meticulous processes. First up is the construction phase. This is where the blueprint comes alive, where the grandeur of the plan transforms into a tangible reality. It's a phase filled with challenges but also brimming with potential. Following the construction, the testing phase comes into play. This is a critical juncture where the river's functionality is put under the microscope. It's about ensuring that every aspect of the project, from the flow of water to the sustainability of the ecosystem, operates flawlessly. The testing phase is the final checkpoint before the river begins to flow freely, marking the official opening of Asia's largest artificial river. Now let's talk about the impact. The ripple effects of this project are monumental, not just for Afghanistan, but for the entire Asian region. Economically, the artificial river is anticipated to be a boon. It promises to boost the local economy, create jobs and foster new industries. But the impact doesn't stop there. Agriculture, a cornerstone of Afghanistan's livelihood, is set for a massive transformation. With a reliable water source, farmers can grow crops year-round, increasing yield and reducing food scarcity. And let's not forget the people, the artificial river carries the promise of improved living standards. It means reliable access to water, better sanitation, and a healthier, happier populace. This project is about giving a new lease of life to millions. The way forward for this project is paved with potential. It's a journey of transformation that will redefine the landscape of Afghanistan and Asia. It's a beacon of hope, a symbol of resilience, and a testament to the power of innovation. This project, once completed, will be a testament to human ingenuity and the power of sustainable development. As we conclude this fascinating journey into the world of artificial rivers, let's reflect on the possibilities they present. Today, we've delved deep into the ambitious project undertaken by Afghanistan, a nation envisioning the creation of Asia's largest artificial river. A venture of this magnitude is not just a testament to human innovation, but also a beacon of hope for nations grappling with water scarcity and environmental challenges. We've explored the intricate blueprint of this project, the strategic planning and the cutting-edge technology that will catalyze the transformation of a dream into reality. This endeavor is not merely about constructing a man-made waterway. It's about crafting a lifeline that will nourish the land, boost agriculture, foster economic growth, and most importantly, provide clean water to millions. However, as we've discussed, this journey is not without its hurdles. The geographical challenges, the financial implications, and the environmental concerns are formidable. But Afghanistan is poised to tackle them head-on, with comprehensive mitigation measures in place. These include employing sustainable construction methods, investing in eco-friendly technologies, and ensuring stringent monitoring to minimize potential environmental impacts. This project, when completed, promises to redefine the landscape of Afghanistan and potentially set a precedent for similar initiatives worldwide. It signifies the triumph of human spirit over adversity and stands as a testament to what we can achieve when we marry innovation with determination. But as we move forward, it's crucial to remember that such monumental endeavors need our support to succeed. And that's where you come in. By spreading awareness about these initiatives, you can play your part in fostering a sustainable future. If you found this video enlightening, please show your support by liking, subscribing and sharing it with your friends. Stay tuned for more thought-provoking content. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning.